So what is the idea or the ideal of autonomy? It really is an ideal in the sense of it's something that, you know, is valuable and that we aim for and that we should want to have if we can in our lives. So everybody cares about different things, right? Um, big and small. Um, I like mint and chip ice cream. A lot of people think that that's, you know, lame, stupid, and terrible. Uh, other people like other kinds of ice cream. Doesn't So each person's tastes, preferences, and desires are, we're all different. The idea of the of autonomy is that it's important for people to try to be able to live the kind of lives that they uh, think are worthwhile, right? We all care about different things. We all have different dreams, goals, aspirations. We all probably want to be different kinds of people, right? Some of you are super outgoing people, pe people, 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 you know. Um, some of you, uh, more like me probably, and way a bit more introverted, um, that makes for different kind of plans about what you do with your day, what do you do with your life. And it would really suck if any of us was made to live the kind of life that someone else wanted us to live, but a life that didn't seem uh, worthwhile to us, right? So any kind of ideal of freedom, of self-determination, of liberty even, um, really what those are all talking about is this value of autonomy, the idea that you um, live the kind of life that seems worth worthwhile for you. Now, I should say, you know, just because you want to uh, be a serial killer or something, if that's, those are your dreams and aspirations, that doesn't mean, you know, sort of autonomously silly, serial killing is actually a worthwhile thing or something that the rest of us should respect, right? Uh, different kinds of values can conflict. And um, of course, some people would say that, you know, you can't autonomously do wrong, but that's probably not as defensible as you might like. So the basic idea then is that each of us is supposed to sort of, as we become adults, try to figure out what matters to us and try to live in accordance with what matters to us. And so to be autonomous means to be, you know, in some sense, um, our idea of what it is to be a grown up, you know, to be an adult, right? So that's the thing that's going to be at stake in a big chunk of the class, right? Um, in a lot of situations, that's going to be the thing that we care about. And that's going to be the answer to many of our questions.